All right, countless voters had the right to do so in November, thanks to Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. The new movie Selma chronicles his epic march in Alabama, which led to the Voting Rights Act. Tonight, local civil rights legends got a red carpet premiere, and KATV News Watch 7's Dave Roberts joins us live. The struggles revived on the silver screen were very real right here in Omaha during the 1960s. Segregation plagued the city, but a few people challenged the hateful status quo. Sometimes people don't even realize the civil rights movement that occurred here in the city. And many of the things, as far as demonstrations and uh, bus boycotts, they happened in Omaha before they even happened in other parts of the country. Living legends, beacons of the Omaha civil rights movement, join a sold out crowd for the premiere of Selma. The movie follows Martin Luther King's quest for equal voting rights and his march from Selma to Montgomery, Alabama in 1965. Dr. Margarita Washington remembers it well and praises the new film. To come alive so that our young people will know that these things actually happen, I think it's tremendous. In the 1960s, she stood up for equal rights in Omaha, a time when the city refused to hire African Americans, when businesses refused service. It wasn't easy getting some of our rights, that it was blood, sweat, and tears. The movement in Omaha centered around churches and faith. We found within ourselves the strength to be able to mount a civil rights movement in the city of Omaha, across the country. The celebration of tonight's premiere comes with a message of hope, hope for youth, and a mission to end the deadly shootings. Nonviolence uh, was the greatest sign of strength, and many of our young people have never heard uh, that message in, in a powerful and clear way, and I think uh, they will hear it if they watch this movie. Because some teens and children can't afford to see this movie, on January 19th, Preston Love and the League of Women Voters will hold a free special screening for Omaha youth at Exarvin Cinema. Back to you. Thanks, Dave.